Welcome back to the show, guys. It is now time for entertainment news. Now, first off, Blessing Igwe speaks on Nollywood stars losing their worth. Nollywood movie producer Blessing Igwe has spoken up about the latest trends of actors giving away their mystery by being too accessible on social media. <laughs> she made this known on Twitter with a series of tweets that were centered on how social media celebrities are influencing the acting profession negatively. She tweeted, and I'm quoting, I miss the mystery of actors. I miss believing their act on screen. They put out so much of themselves and their everyday lives on social media that we no longer can separate their screen life from the real life. It is even worse for actors who can't change or become a character. Movie stars, I believe, should have mystery and preserve the belief factor for art's sake. I wonder if it's the pressure created by many brands to only identify with stars with millions of followers that have ignited the struggle in actors to show self and become too accessible. She then continued saying, most have become reality stars, some comedians, other liars, all to grow the brand, quote unquote. Now fans know their everyday activities, they know when they wake up, when they orgasm, and when they fly top mm -hmm. class. One can actually write a book about some just by following their daily loggings. She then concluded by preferring a solution stating, so what to do? Writers create challenging characters. Casting directors do not cast actors as is. Producers do not insist on actors for their large following, but for their skill. Actors learn to step away from their self and immerse. Directors work with actors to become the characters. Amen, somebody? Amen. Ooh, that's, that's a table that she's shaking. And it's about a break. That, what are you thinking? No, that table is broken. It's, it's broken. made of mahogany, <laughs> and she's going to pay for this table, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly speaking, I think she has a point. I think she has so many points. Mm -hmm. Of course, you can always just uh, take her out of context because I know that that is what some people will do, you know. But then she has a lot of points. Yeah. Uh, they, um, well, well, do we say actors are entertainers? Mm -hmm. And so uh, sometimes maybe they need to like, especially this lockdown period, mm -hmm. uh, which most of them turned... No thanks to TikTok, they nah. turned comedians already, <laughs> yeah. which is good. People are loving it. Mm -hmm. They're loving the fact that they're entertaining them and all of this. But then I love the fact that she is complaining and then she's given a solution. Mm -hmm. It would be another mm -hmm. thing if you're not preferring any solution mm -hmm. at the end of mm -hmm. today. And I particularly like the fact that she said that not because of the following of people on social media, that is the reason you give them cast. Jobs. And it is almost everywhere yeah. in every industry. In every industry right so sometimes now. some people don't know the ethics of the job, but then because you see that, oh, they have a brand mm -hmm. and then this, that, 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 mm -hmm. that. And so you bring them on the job and it slows down the job because other people who have experience are now spoon feeding them. Mm -hmm. And it's just lines. so sad. Very, very sad. So I said um, particularly that she had a point uh, because there are some things I disagree with. You know, this is 2020, when in a digital age where social media is very, very relevant. Now, however, it doesn't mean that you should pick um, an actor or an actress just because of their following on Instagram. But you cannot take it away and say, oh, because I'm trying to preserve my character, I'm trying to preserve my you know, mystery, I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to evade or I'm going to like exclude myself from social media. That also doesn't make sense. So I feel like the way it should be done is what is your brand about? You know, because a lot of actors, as she said, have now become comedians, have become liars, they're, they're taking pictures with cars and taking pictures with houses and all sorts of things that have nothing to do with acting. You know, when you even look at foreign celebrities, when you look at a Beyonce's page, she doesn't put out anything private and she even spoke about it the other day that privacy is no more a thing. You can grow your following, you can be very much on social media. Let's see you acting, let's see you immersing yourself in monologues, let's see you doing things that are related to acting, let's see you reading the scripts. Let's not see you like posing in front of a car. So I feel like it has to be a balance where she broke a lot of tables by saying, you know what, even as actors, a lot of people that she said mm. cannot even separate their character from their real life. So it's, it's just something that you have to consider. It's, it's not something we can finish talking about right now, of but course. it's something that you have to balance out very well. Okay.